afternoon. I am a member of the class of 1994 and have just completed my second year as chair of the AABC Fellowship Committee, a standing committee of the AABC board. It's actually my fifth year altogether. I was a committee member for the first three years and now committed. I'm, the past two years I've been chair. The ABC Fellowship for Graduate Study is funded by a gift from the Edith and Francis Mohall Achilles Memorial Fund. Edith was class of 14, 1914, <laughs> and Francis was class of 1945. Fellowships for full-time graduate study are awarded by the Fellowship Committee to graduating seniors and alumni of all ages who show a clear interest in their field of study, demonstrate strong motivation and potential for accomplishment, and present a creative approach to their work and a willingness to explore uncharted territory. This was a remarkable year for fellowship applications. We received 100 applications. It's unheard of. Almost 20 as, as twice as many as in previous years. And that's a lot of work. Um, it made the committee's task of choosing among them even more challenging. Uh, staff support, student support in the office, tremendous. We needed, we needed that support, so thank you for providing that. So we're delighted to award five fellowships this year. The applicants continue to demonstrate the exceptional accomplishments and dedication of purpose of Barnard alumni. Three of the recipients are here today and you will meet them shortly, but first I would like to tell you about the other two fellows who are not able to join us this afternoon. Alicia Mountain is class of 2010. She's currently a PhD student in poetry at the University of Denver. She earned an MFA at the University of Montana in Missoula in 2015. A prolific poet, Alicia was the recipient of the Iowa Poetry Prize for her recently published first collection, High Ground Coward. Everybody go out and buy it. She has been a push, push I'm sorry, I'm having problems today. A Pushcart Prize nominee and Idlewild Arts Fellow. Alicia is a lesbian poet and assistant editor of the Denver Quarterly. Ashley Wagner, class of 2014, is a Master of Public Health and Master of City Planning student at the University of California, Berkeley. She graduated from Barnard with a degree in environmental science and human rights. <clears throat> Her interest in studies focus on how ecological sanitation can be used to promote societal and environmental justice, and she hopes to develop a participatory planning process that integrates resource recovery into urban development projects. Actually, the questions for her during the interview were very interesting because we all wanted to know about toilets and sanitation. It was, it was kind of fun. I would now like to invite Ariel Fine to join me on stage. Ariel, class of 2011, is a PhD candidate in the History of Art Department at Yale University, specializing in Byzantine and Islamic art. After graduating from the double degree program between Barnard and the Jewish Theological Seminary with BAs in Art History and Medieval Jewish Studies, she earned her MA in Byzantine Art History from the Courtauld Institute of Art in London. Her dissertation explores the 12th century church in Palermo, Sicily, which reflects the integration of the varied artistic languages of Romanesque, Byzantine, and Islamic. In addition to her studies, Ariel is a passionate educator. Congratulations. must have gotten it right because she was nodding the whole time. Um, Penelope Myers Usher, please join me on stage. Oops, I'll get it ready this time. Penelope, a member of the Barnard class of 2011, is a PhD student in English at New York University. Her dissertation, Violent Metamorphoses, the Indeterminate Body in Early Modern English Tragedy, examines the various ways in which acts of violence transform bodies. Working with both canonical and less canonical plays by Shakespeare and his contemporaries, a period when bloody works were increasingly produced for stage, she studies how this actually transforms bodies into states that are messy, incoherent, and in between. And actually, I'm going to take the opportunity to read, you can all hopefully look at this and cogitate on it at home after a reunion, but I just want to point out one sentence. This is pulled from her application, that, and it just struck all of us on the committee. She further argues that the ind invisible blood, mangled limbs, and expressive organs scattered throughout Renaissance drama speak in urgent ways to our current social and political moment and to the tragic lives and deaths of bodies today by bringing attention to the body's messy materiality. 
congratulations on your fellowship. Anna Ziering, please join me on stage. Anna, also a member of Barnard's class of 2011, is a PhD student in English at the University of Connecticut. Her research centers on the play of race, sex, and time. Her dissertation focuses on the question of how alternative subject formations operating inside neoliberalism might find room for agency, while considering how the influence of queer time and racialized subjectivities might be employed in service of radical political practice. Anna teaches first year writing courses, here at Barnard, right? No? Oh, well, we'll have to fix that. Uh, centered around identity, borderlands, American protest literature, higher education in the US, and immigrant narratives. Congratulations, Anna. Please join me in congratulating all of these extraordinary women as we look forward to hearing about their future studies and professional accomplishments. Last but certainly not least, I would also like to thank my fellow committee members who are, I know a couple of you are here, uh, for their thoughtful dedication, hard work, and many hours, many, many, many hours required to select this year's awardees from an unusually large pool of candidates. FYI, applications for the 2019 fellowship will be available in the fall. Notification will be posted on the alumni website. Thank you.